All right, all right. Welcome back to Detail It. <laughs> so this is going to be a couple of quick products. I'm trying to do it quick. My daughter's leaving in like five minutes for work. But uh, there's a gentleman out there that runs a detailing academy. And he talks about shiny scratches. So my boss said to me, Doug, what's shiny scratches? What does he mean? So try to do this as quick and as seamless as I can with Q7 Detailer by CSI and Q7 Wax, also CSI. So this right here, I'm a little bit kind of feeling rushed, right? And you know that because you can see it on my face. My attention isn't on the screen or you, and I apologize. Here's what it means. <clears throat> this car actually has trashed paint. Well, it's not trashed, but it's definitely not good. It's used. It's got 130,000 on it. I was gonna detail it and go all in on this car and detail it, <clears throat> but we've decided she wants to buy a newer car and just take on a payment, so that's what we're gonna do. But anyway, this is shiny scratches, okay? Little bit of detailer, bam. Buff it off. And if you're gonna use the Q7 technology, you don't need to dry it all the way. That was a Q7 detailer. It's kind of like what I would call a primer. <clears throat> Very versatile product. I'm gonna use the Q7 wax. Shake it, man, shake it, shake it. Like your booty, shake it. I'm gonna put it on the rag. That's probably overused, but that's okay. Spread it in. Work it in. Spread it out. However you want to call it. Call me out. I'm cool with it. Let it haze. And buff off. So, by the way, while we're making this video, give a shout out to uh, CSI. Uh, Mr. Tom Horvath and Darren Priest, thank you for the Q7 detailer. And uh, this one here I bought, Q7 wax, had to try it. It is a great wax, easy to use. Uh, CSI is releasing a coating soon, and that's what I was going to put on this car, but I'll probably put it on the red car instead because we're selling the white one. <sighs> ah, so that said that we're selling the white one, Anybody interested in a 2011 Kia Optima EX? It's in decent shape. I put a bunch of money in it when we bought it. Not because it had bad parts, but because I wanted a reliable vehicle for my daughter. So uh, DM me at 2DetailIt on Instagram, and we can talk about it. Anyway, let this haze up. Buff it off. Super easy on, super easy off. I can't imagine wanting to use a process harder than that, because... That, my friends, is simple. I'm gonna bring you in here. That is slick, too. It's a great product. So I'm gonna bring you in and show you this. Hopefully I can catch it on the camera. Pointing up at the sky, just trying to get angle on my camera. So you see all the scratches, all the swirls? Yeah, because this needed full correcting. I'm not gonna do that now. Not that we're selling it, unless they pay extra for it, and then I will. So then when you come across here, to the waxed portion. I don't know what you're seeing there. A little bit glossier, a little bit more shiny, because it's waxed, right? And it is slick. So that, my friends, for those of you wondering, if you watch Ivan LaCroix's Detailing Academy, that is shiny scratches. That's what it amounts to. Most people in the world, not just where I live or anywhere on the globe, just want shiny scratches. Most people don't care if you polish their car. So that is what is said and meant, uh, not said and meant, but that is what is meant by shiny scratches. That's it. That's all there is to it, guys. So if you want a super easy product and you want some shiny scratches, check out uh, the boys in SoCal at CSI. Give you a shot here. Give you a little banner. The hat. They didn't give me this, I made it. The hoodie, which you've seen, could probably make you one, but it would be very costly to ship to you. And then this, thank you Tom. He sent it to me, because I love his product. 
CSI, give them some love. And then here's a glimpse of a couple of their products that you can buy at uh, CSIShine.com. So, hey, thanks for tuning in. That was a quick one. It was a rushed one, and I felt it. I hope it's good content. That is shiny scratches when you just wax over the car in current condition. And, yes, this was prepped. I used cleaners and liquid clays on it, guys. Yes, it was prepped. It was not polished. Some of you think prepping is polished. Okay. I, I don't... If you're just doing shiny scratches, you don't have to polish it, right? You're just shining the surface current condition so there you go shiny scratches thank you that goes out to ryan craig james jared brandon eric and i won't say his last name because that would give it all away but anyway he has like 18 names <laughs> thanks for tuning in watch next week take care